This is a ring device, mostly used for homes to establish communication from your front door like a doorbell. This is your mobile device or tablet. This is the ring application that established communication between the two. We commonly use it for our lobby or office space. To utilize it, what you like to do is you have to have the Ring app on your device, mobile, iPhone, Android, it doesn't matter, a tablet, etc. You can also put it in your Windows or Mac computer as well. To establish sound, what you want to do is on the device, you go to App Alerts, Ring Alerts, Sound, and you establish the type of sound you like. Wind chimes, ring doorbell notification, Westminster quarters. For us, we utilize this one. Someone's at your door. That's the sound we want to hear when somebody hits the button and wants to alert that somebody is in our lobby. So what we want to do is when somebody hits the button, someone's at your door you will get the notification and the sound. You hit the tap and it will open communication between the two. Now what you need to do is to talk, you're gonna hit the green button to end the call. Just like a phone, you hit the red button. You have to hit the red button to disconnect the two, otherwise this will not pick up again. As you will see in about 30 seconds, this will be ready for somebody else to hit a button yet again. Most common mistakes are when somebody is viewing this and they have it on live view, they leave it on, which keeps the communication between the two and the ring will not alert the devices. An example, if I am clicking here and hitting live view, I've established communication between the two as an open source. Also, you will notice that when you have it on live view, the buttons do go away. So if somebody was to alert me, you're not gonna see those buttons. If you tap on the screen, the buttons come back. When you are on live view, you will not get a notification as you are directly connected. You can see this, and you can see this is not doing anything as you already have an open communication. I mostly would advise getting out of that, staying on this screen, staying on that tablet. You can even have the phone off or tablet off. So when somebody does hit the button, you get an alert. Proper way to do it. Let me know if you have any questions or need to learn more about the Ring device. You can also go to ring.com and learn more about the device and its procedures.